Hey, this is Rene. Welcome to this video. And today we will test the morning and evening star chart pattern um, for the last two years. So we will have a look at every single trade this pattern indicated in the last two years. And we will do this using um, the pattern detector expert advisor. If you are interested in um, using this expert advisor for yourself, check out the videos um, how I built this program on this channel. You will find every single line of code and you can copy it on your own uh, MetaTrader 5. But what does this um, expert advisor do? So we can test chart patterns. We can test the hammer chart pattern, the bullish and bearish engulfing, and the morning and evening star pattern. And this is what we will do in this video. We already tested the other two chart patterns in the previous two videos. So if you are interested in the results there, you should have a look at um, the previous two videos. But first of all, before we make a optimization to find the best results or the best settings, for this chart pattern, I will show you the chart pattern real quick in a visualized uh, test mode here. So I can run the tester and if I speed it up a little bit, you can see as soon as there is a morning star pattern, for example, here these three candles build a morning star pattern, we see that a trade is made in the strategy. Whoops, this was a little bit too fast. You can see that a trade is made in the strategy tester. I think it was this trade. And this trade then has a um, profit or a TP level and a SL level. And we then check which of these levels will um, be reached first. So um, this works uh, works for morning star patterns and also for evening star patterns as we see one here on the screen. Like these three candles here, maybe I can zoom in a little bit more. Um, these, these three candles build the evening star chart pattern. And with the beginning of the next candle, so as soon as the pattern is finished, we open a trade in the direction that um, the chart pattern indicates. And then we place a TP and a SL, and then we just wait until one of them is reached. So this is a great way to figure out if a chart pattern is worth looking at because this way we always get like the percentage or the chance of winning a trade and we do not have a filter or trading stop that might um, push the um, the uh, like the result in, in one uh, or the other direction. And this is pretty much how the um, how the program works and how we can test these signals. And I can let this program work for the complete period. And this is a visualized test, which uh, takes a little bit longer than a not visualized test. And also we have the chance or the option to optimize in the MetaTrader 5 tester. So I can click here in the overview. I click on complete optimization. And then I... Um, leave everything uh, everything as it is on this settings page. So we still have the pattern detector in the Euro US dollar chart. It's a one hour chart and we have the last two years as a custom period selected. Then we can have a look at the inputs here and now we can choose um, uh, rows that we want to optimize. So for example, in this case, we want to optimize the TP and the SL points. So we start with a setting of 500 for both of these, and then we increase it by a step of 100 until we reach a maximum of 1000 points for the TP and SL points. So by optimizing these two inputs, we, and like for combining every single, um, uh, setting here, we get a total of 36 combinations. And if I click on start, we will now test all of these 36 combinations in the euro, euro, dollar for the last two years. So once this is finished, so you can see here in the agents tab, it is now working and you see the percentage of the test. So once this is finished, we will see the optimization results here and also up here. Um, where I am now with my cursor. So you can see all the passes here and you can also see the profit factor. So if I refresh this, you can see here we also get the results like we already have around 10 tests finished. This is really fast in the MetaTrader 5 tester and you can always see the results. So this result 
column here, it is the profit factor and a profit factor of above one means that this test was profitable and a profit factor below one means that we made a, um, uh, a loss Oh, we, we, yeah, we made a loss over the last two years. And we will now see what happens more often. And then we can compare to the, to the result of the hammer and the, um, the engulfing chart pattern. So, um, yeah, the test is nearly finished. You can see all the results up here and here in the optimization results tab. So, we can see it now here, so you can see a lot of these tests um, did not um, run in the in profit, but also on the other hand, a lot made a profit. I think we have a little bit more tests that were negative, but also we have a good amount of tests that were positive, and we can also see that if we want to look at a single test, like the best test, we can double click this. Uh, like the first row, for example, and then it will automatically start a single backtest for this chart pattern here. And yeah, this would be the result with the best settings that we tested for the last two years. And what we can also do is, since we tested the, since we also tested the hammer and the engulfing signal, we can have a look at the results there. So what we did here is, um, or what we can see here is, we can also see the previous test runs. Um, so this was the run that we did right now. This was the um, whoops. This was the um, the star. So the the morning and evening star result. So we see a the best profit factor was around one um, dot ten. And then we see 1.9, etc., etc. And if we look at the previous test, which was the morning and evening star, we see that the results here were, I would say, a lot better. So we have more profitable um, outcomes. So the like the ratio of positive tests compared to negative tests is higher. So we should say that for this period of time, for this market in this time frame, the um, bullish and bearish engulfing work better than the morning and evening star. And if we have a look at the test that we did before this test, we will find the hammer chart pattern, pattern. And this was like not really good. So this was by far the worst optimization run. So if we would make a ranking of these three chart patterns, we would say the bullish and bearish engulfing was the best. Then uh, the morning and evening star comes in second place and the worst scenario was like the hammer chart signal. And this is, I think, a really good information after doing all of these tests. And we can also see that um, like the profit factor for some of the test runs with the uh, morning and evening star Oh no, th the bullish and bearish engulfing. Some of these tests were like really good. So this might be even worth looking at and maybe adding some filters or maybe, yeah, even have a look at the times when you open the trades, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So this is how you can um, test. Also, let's have a look at the amount of trades. Yeah, we can see the hammer signal was, of course, the test that produced the, the most trades and then uh, followed by the bullish and bearish engulfing, and then followed by the morning and evening star. That this is not a coincidence, I think. It is because the hammer chart pattern only has one candle that builds like the complete pattern, and the bullish and bearish engulfing needs two candles, and the morning and evening star uh, needs three candles. So I think this is why um, yeah, we have a lot of trades for the hammer and not really many trades for the um, for the morning and evening star, right? And yeah, this is, I think, like enough for for the test runs uh, for this um, 
Pattern Detector program. And again, you can use this program. You can make your own tests in every market, in every time frame with all the TP points and SL point settings that you like. Just watch the previous videos where I explained how you can write this program in MetaTrader 5 and then you can use it. You can make exactly the same tests as I did and you can even modify the program. So um, now I only want to hear uh, in the end what you think about these tests. Do you have experience with these chart patterns? Maybe you traded them manually or with an expert advisor. Let me know what you think about it below in the comment section. And also let me know what kind of videos you want to do, uh, want to see next. Should I work on this pattern detector even more? Maybe add a filter or should I work on other topics? Of course, I cannot make a video for every single request. This is right now at this point not not possible because I get too many requests, but I always have a look at every single comment and I always um, uh, take everything into consideration and then, yeah, look what is requested often and then make a video for this for this uh, specific topic. Topic. So um, in the end, thanks for watching. Hope you liked the little um, ending um, for the pattern detector series and I, will ho I hope that we see each other in the next video. Until then, have a great time and good Trades. Bye-bye.